problem. That's how you know Easter's right around the corner. What do you mean? Hey, remember that story I told you last year where Grandpa and the East Bunny don't get along? Oh, right, 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 right. No. Okay, well, one year when Grandpa went to the mall to take his photo with the Easter Bunny, he found out he was allergic to the Easter Bunny. He sneezed right in the middle of the photo and his dentures flew right out of his mouth. The Easter Bunny took the photo and posted it all over his social medias. That's hilarious. <laughs> but uh, why don't you just go over there and ask him to come down? You wanna try that? Yeah. Hey, hey. Grandpa, do you mind if you just cool off a little bit? <laughs> Is that supposed to be funny? Yeah. <laughs> Well, uh, that didn't work. I see that. Hmm. Yeah. Wanna go get a snack? Yeah. Psst! Andrew! Are you gonna hit me again? What? No! You like candy, right? Yeah, who doesn't? What would you say if I told you I could get you unlimited candy? How would you do that? If you helped me capture the Easter Bunny, you'd have all the candy you could ever dream of. What? Capture the Easter Bunny? No, Grandpa, that's ridiculous. No, it's not. Why would you even need my help to capture him? Because you're a good boy! No, I'm not. The Easter Bunny wouldn't step foot in my room. But maybe with your help, he'll come bring me candy, and then I can grab him! Grandpa, I don't know. Come on, it'll be good for both of us. I'll get my revenge, and you'll get unlimited candy. I mean, I do want unlimited candy. But Easter's tomorrow. How are we even going to pull this off? We have to find a way to make me look good so the Easter Bunny will come visit. And we can't let Anthony know. If he finds out, he'll put a stop to our plans. <sighs> okay, I'll try. Oh, and one more thing. Yeah? How'd you get that stain on your shirt? What? I don't know. I don't, I, what? I don't know. Well, you gotta make up a cool story about how you got it. People are gonna ask. What? Why would anyone ask? Whatever. Go get me that buddy. So, uh, Anthony, if you were like trying to get the Easter Bunny to come here, like, how would you do it? I mean, he comes every year. He's the Easter Bunny. Let's just say, hy hypothetically speaking, that the Easter Bunny doesn't like me. I was bad. Like that. Like, how would I get him? To call him that. You can use the peep on a perch. What? Well, you know my elf on the shelf. Yeah. Well, it's the same thing. It's a little peep that sits on the shelf, and he reports to the Easter Bunny on how good or bad you've been. And if you've been good, the Easter Bunny, I guess, will come. Hmm. So let's say I wanted to get one of these <laughs> peeps on a perch. How would I do that? Oh, I have them. Right over there. Can I just... I, can I just try it? Sure. Right now? I guess? I guess so. Thank, thank you. Andrew? Yeah? Gotta ask. How'd you get that stain on your shirt? Oh, um... Um... Uh, pirates! Huh. Cool. Grandpa! Grandpa! Whoa. I got it! Through the way! No, I got it. We're gonna get the bunny? Yes, and I know exactly how we're gonna do it. Alright, what's the plan? Give it to me! A peep on a perch. The peep on a perch? Yes, exactly. So it's just like the elf on the shelf, so if you do good things, the people go tell the Easter Bunny, and he'll be bringing you candy in the morning. Go on. But the only difference is you can touch the peep, so it might just be in the right spot when you're doing good deeds. Well, what if I don't do any good deeds? Grandpa, we're gonna fake them. Oh, I like the way you think. So, where do we begin? All right, I'm gonna show you how to make my famous prune case, because I know how much you love them. Yeah, I love them. Well, let me put this peep down first. Yeah, you're gonna need two hands. You're really not picking this up, are you? Picking what up? All right, well first, you gotta need to put on this apron. You can't afford another stain. Apron, yeah, okay. Hey, Grandpa, I'm not sure where you are, but could you help me with my history homework? Oh, well, of course I have yet to study today, but uh, I'm sure I can help you. I probably lived through it anyway. Okay, question one. All right. Who was the first president? Me. Me. Oh, hello, Grandpa. Hello. I didn't see you there. No. Nah. But I'm glad you're here, because I need help tying my shoes. Whoa. Whoa. Andrew. Yeah? 
You don't have any lightsabers. Oh, oh. Okay. Stir it. Stir it. Keep stirring. Question two. Who freed the slaves? Also me. Also me. Okay, a hundred for sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, did I say tie my shoes? Oh. I meant, uh, show me your moves. What? Pants. Oh. Uh, you, you do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around! That's what it's all about, ladies! Nice. Alright, well, catch you on the flip side! See you later, Grandpa! Oh, I'll go this way! Yeah, okay. Stir it. Stir it. Do you hear that? Anthony's coming! Grandpa, are you sure? This is supposed to bubble like this? What are you doing? Oh, me and Grandpa are just making some prune cakes. Right, Grandpa? Grandpa. Why is he teaching you how to make prune cakes? Oh, so we can capture the bunny. I mean, uh, so we can get some honeys. You're trying to get honeys with my Grandpa? Well, um... For you! Yeah, we're getting them for you. Because you can't find that love. Really? Just trying to help you out. Okay. Cakes are burning. Is he gone? Yeah, he just left. Perfect. As soon as we finish making those prune cakes, the honeys will be mine. Grandpa, we're trying to catch the Easter Bunny. Oh yeah, that too. Yes, yes. All right, tie him up. We got him. <laughs> Whew. I'm a little dizzy. Can you finish this up for me? What? No, just keep tying him up! I'm gonna call Animal Control! We're sorry. Animal Control is closed right now. Our normal oh. business hours are 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. Goodbye! <sighs> Great! What do we do now? I guess we'll just have to keep him here until morning. How do we make sure that Anthony doesn't come in? Grandpa, I took care of him. All right, good. And then come morning, animal control will be here, and the bunny will be out of our way once and for all! Oh, by the way, why are you wearing that mask? I want them to know my real identity. All right, whatever. I'm going to bed. Watch him overnight. I got my eyes on you. Boys only, no bunnies! Did they tie you up? Why'd they do this? Okay, let's get out of here. <sighs> pirates. You know, pirates. Like, you know, pirates! Pirates! Oh, let's just get out of here! <laughs> what? Oh, you're awake. Great. Uh, yeah, the bunny's gone. You let him go? Well, no. But, he probably left some eggs. <sighs> Peter Cottontail slipped through my fingers one last time. But next year, I'm gonna get him. Woohoo! Yeah! Next year. Yeah, don't do that. Hey, what's up, you guys? Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see some bloopers and behind the scenes for this video, you can click the link right above my head at the end of the video or in the description down below to go check them out right now. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like, leave a comment down below letting us know what you thought, and subscribe for more videos coming soon. Don't forget to follow us on our social medias, our Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. The links to everything are down below. And we will see you guys again very soon with a brand new video. Bye, guys.